In this Python nice GUI tutorial, we will make an application with a table element. After entering the values into the input objects, the data is saved to the table when the button is pressed. In the video, I will show step by step how to do this application. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video. So let's start. I am creating a variable. I will create an input object for name. I save the code file and run it. I added the input object for name to the web page. I will create an input object for age. I save the code file and run it. I added the input object for age to the web page. I will add a button element. I can do this using the button function. I am saving the code file. I added a button to the web page. I am creating a list for the column. I add name and age values to the list. Label represents the column name, and field represents its counterpart in the row list. I create an empty list for rows. I will create a table object. I send the lists I created for rows and columns to the table function. I am saving the code file. I added the table element to the web page. It doesn't have any data yet. My goal is to save the data entered into the input object into the table element when the button is clicked. To do this, I will call a function using the onClick property. I define the function. I'm creating a new dictionary. I can access name and age information by using the value function. I add the dictionary I created with the append function to the list. I am updating the table. Finally, I save the name and age values with empty strings. I am saving the code file. After entering the values into the input objects, the data is saved to the table when the button is pressed. I'm making a few tries. In this video, we learned how to use the table element. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video.